Now this is perfect eye discipline at the top of a route of a receiver. We're gonna pay attention to this slot, nickel DB. Now the receiver's gonna run an out route. Right now, he has help with the top. So he's in, I don't know if this two man or two man trail. When that receiver breaks out, his helmet does not come back and look at the quarterback. He takes one, two. Now his head is back. He drives on the receiver first. Now he's got enough time to get his head back. You have to drive at least two steps. One, two. Now you can get your head back if you feel like you're in good position. One, two. Head back. You don't turn your head back right here for a multitude of reasons. One, if you turn your head back right now on the cut, you're probably going to veer off on top of the receiver because your body's just going to go above the receiver. Just like when the receiver turns his head right here, he veers about a yard or two off of where he cuts. All right? So he drives one, two, head back. Now, you can go one, two, head back. Now, if you are not there, you can, again, put your eyes on the receiver and close ground by a half a yard or so. One, two, head back. He also knows the sidelines there, so the receiver cannot escape him as far if he was on this hash. He would probably drive a couple more steps. Sidelines there. Great play. Almost a pick. That's all because of eye discipline at the top of the route right there. His head does not turn around when the receiver breaks out. He takes his couple drive steps. Now he can be aggressive because he's in phase. Great eye discipline.